Okay, um, so ball striking for direction this month. Um, so really simple. Let me just take this video back to the beginning. Um, there's a couple of factors that are really important here. And to be honest with you, um, if we look at the right hand side first, essentially what we're looking for is side to side weight transfer properly. So if you notice, I've got a line up my right hip. I've got a line up my left from my left ankle straight up in the air and I've got a line on my left ear. So if you watch how this works, what you're looking for is rotation in the lower body, in the backswing, so no sideways hip movement. You're looking for a little bit of head movement to the, to the right, so as we're looking at it to the left, um, at the top of the backswing. Then the head will pop back to where it started. It'll hold still, perhaps move back fractionally, and then through into the left side. So you can see the line up the left side there, that becomes almost a wall that you get up against when you've hit it, which means that you're transferring your weight side to side well. That's one factor in hitting the ball in the right direction. Okay, looking at the other angle now, left hand side view, the key really here is, if you notice, I've put a line up from the heel of the club to the back of my right elbow, and that's what we call the plane line. And it's really fundamental. So if you watch me take the club back, the key is, if you see the line I've drawn just above my knees, this is a key point. So what I want is I'm looking for the club head to travel up that line and down that line on the way down through and after impact there. So it's staying on the line all the way through that. That'll pretty much guarantee straight shots or straighter. Mm -hmm.